Hey guys, so I thought a while ago I initially I had like a small one of this and then I decided I want uh, four ounces, 118 ml, which is Queen Acridone Nickel is a gold by Golden. And this I will just come close so that you see the color. It's semi transparent and it gives. Um, it gives a very unique yellow color. It's not gold, it's not yellow, you know, something like, and it's beautiful. So I was like, you know, I was actually experimenting, guys. And and then I thought, let me just see. So what I did is, one sec, one sec, please. Let me grab it. So, I had some burnished copper uh, by Josania or whatever burnished copper that you have. You could also have it by, uh, like, uh, from a pigment. But anyway, this is a mixed uh, one, quite thick. And then what I did is I took also primary yellow, which is uh, half transparent um, uh, from Liquitex Basics. And I added, I started adding equal parts of each. And then I kept, of course, the burnished copper will be predominant, right? So what I did is uh, I start with one part burnished copper, and I added one part Liquitex Basics, which is mixed already, huh? I'm talking about like, you mix all the colors and that's the way I discovered it. So, uh, and then I added equal part and then um, more and more. I think I added two parts and a half of the mixed primary yellow and to one part of burnished cover and look at this guys I mean I will show you of course when you mix burnished copper see guys when you mix it it's different than when you see the color like you know uh, in the bottle itself and then look at this I just I just tried this now Look at this, isn't this, isn't this the color of Queen Acridol Nickel Ezo uh, Gold by Golden? That is it, this one in the middle here. The predominant color here, that is it. Good tip, I hope so. <laughs> to more discoveries, bye for now.